I carried out an analysis to determine if uh, Model 3 sales of 500000 a year will be realistic. Uh, I started by looking at Model S sales and what they've done as far as conquest sales from competitive automakers and also just additional sales that are from buyers maybe moving up or that have not considered uh, the Model S uh, or vehicles in that category. Uh, but anyhow, so if we look at what the Model S did. It, last year it sold approximately 8,000 vehicles that I would say could be contributed to conquest sales and it sold additionally an additional 17,000 vehicles, so a total of about 25,000 vehicles. Now we look at the vehicles that are going to be competing with the Model 3 uh, and assume a similar percentage uh, of conquest sales. We have about uh, 99,000 or about 100,000 conquest sales, uh, basically sales taken from the 900,000 uh, sales of the competitor, and maybe 200 thousand or so additional sales from people uh, moving up from lower category vehicles or vehicle or just people purchasing the vehicle because they just are so excited about it and not necessarily in the market so if I total these two numbers I get about 300,000 US sales and the Model S has sold about half of its sales in the US and half in the rest of the world so by doubling that number you get the total uh, world sales for the pot Model 3 potentially which is uh, you know close to the 500,000 that Tesla is targeting. So it seems like 500,000 is is quite a, a doable number if it follows a similar pattern of dominance as the Model S has.